Hi everyone and welcome to today's Paper Possum Friday feature video. Today I'm going to be talking about my Tupperware Microwave Stack Cooker. This is a product that Tupperware puts out that I absolutely love. I'm going to demonstrate today how I cook my favorite food in it, which is popcorn. I eat popcorn every day. I'm not kidding. And a couple of years ago when all the news stories were out about popcorn lung, um, I, I took a lot of teasing from my friends and my family because they all knew how much I absolutely adore popcorn. So this way I get my popcorn fix and I get it with the fats completely in my control and no chemicals. So I really love that. Uh, it's today's Friday feature because it is on sale. Today is the last day that you can buy the Tupperware Stack Cooker on sale um, at a fraction of the price. What you see here is your basic starter set. It is the cone that you use for making cakes. You have the deep bowl and then you also get the lid and it doubles as a shallow casserole as well. And then of course you get a quick little how to use it, how to care for it, few recipes and this uh, seal so that you can make some goodies and transport them. So it's really, it's a nice basic starter set. It is on sale today, uh, last day for $58. That's a savings of $25. Or if you love it as much as I do, um, you'll do what I did and that is order the super set and that is you get all of these pieces, the colander, so that's what you would use to steam vegetables. Um, it's also a great way to make meatloaf and strain the fat off. There's the two piece set that you see, a stacking measuring cup a shallow casserole dish which is a little bit shallower, um, a little bit deeper than this lid here but still the same width because all of these pieces as the name implies stack. So anyway you can go online to my paperpossum.com and click on my Tupperware tab and that will take you right to today's deals and sales and you can buy this from me today and I highly 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 recommend it for more than just popcorn but popcorn is my favorite food so that's what I'm going to show you how to make today. So the first thing we're going to do that you do you need your basic pieces that it comes with there is, we won't be using the cake piece, so we'll set that aside. And uh, you need your lid and you need your base. And into your base, you want to put one half cup of regular popping kernels. Just, I buy the no name. I do not shell out for the expensive. I find that um, they pop the same. <laughs> like, you don't get any more or any less and I really really enjoy um, the flavor of just the no name like uh, Mr. O his popcorn his raw kernels don't really taste any different to me and trust me I'm would be considered a connoisseur now you can pop it just like this you do not have to add any oil whatsoever and it will pop lovely and just fine however um, if you've ever had air popped popcorn you know that it can be a little dry so unless you're going to be adding butter afterwards um, I do recommend a tablespoon of oil and just one tablespoon I use sunflower oil uh, peanut oil also gives it a lovely flavor but I like sunflower oil and it's uh, my oil of choice for most things you just pour it right in that's just a tablespoon and then I put the lid on it, and this is the fun part. This is the part that anytime there's little kids in the house, this is the part they want to help me with. Um, and that is the shaking. I give it a good shake. So you just want to get a little bit of the oil coated onto all of the popcorn kernels. There you go, and you can see. So it's just coated in there, nothing special. And then I'm going to pop that in the microwave, just like this. So my microwave's over my stove, so you can see me open it, but you probably heard. My microwave is a 1200 watt microwave oven, so that's pretty standard. 
Um, I do not use the popcorn button. The popcorn button only does two minutes and 30 seconds. And I find that in a 1200 watt microwave, you want exactly four minutes. So we'll put four minutes on and press start. Okay, so you hear that going. The other thing you might see that I have out here is the pink that's a bowl. Now, the pink that's a bowl here, look how deep that is. That's gonna be a perfect popcorn bowl. Um, you'll see exactly how much popcorn half a cup pops up to be when uh, we dump it into our that's a bowl. Let me come out and zoom a little bit. Right now, well not right now, um, starting tomorrow, the Thatsa Bowls are going to be featured in the October uh, flyer for Tupperware. So you can go to my website tomorrow and get a look at that. But basically you'll be able to get eight of these bowls in four different sizes for a super, super great deal. And of course, how much do you just love the pink color? Um, I just love it. The, it's Pink is my favorite color. I have a lot of um, other colors. I like bright colors, but anything in pink usually is a winner, winner, chicken dinner for me. And so you'll see in the October flyer, which is of course, um, October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and you'll see lots and lots and lots of pink things in the October flyer. So log on tomorrow, have a look, get a good see at it. If you want anything, if you'd like to host a party, book a party. That's the best way to get a good deal. Uh, go ahead and shoot me an email and I'd be happy to put that out for you. You can hear that popcorn starting to pop in the microwave. Now, you do not have to stand over it like I'm standing over it. I'm just doing that right now because I'm shooting a video. So, <laughs> if I weren't shooting the video, I would be walking away. Now, when it's done popping, you don't want to leave it in the microwave for a long, long time, but you don't have to rush right to it because uh, it just it takes a little bit of effort to burn it. Okay, here we are. It's about eight, seven, counting it down, less than 10 seconds. You can hear that the pop popcorn has slowed down in the popping. Um, still a couple are coming off, so we'll open it up. You can remove it right from the microwave. It is, the handles stay nice and cool to the touch, so I don't have to worry about burning myself. I don't have to worry about my kids burning themselves. Now the bowl of the popcorn, it is quite warm. So just touch the handles. We'll take the lid off. There's the steam. Oh, can you see the steam? I love popcorn. I wish there was smell vision because, oh, I just adore popcorn. So we'll set that aside to be washed. Bring in my fats bowl. And you just dump the popcorn in. Just like that. There's a couple of stragglers. We'll get those right in there. Set it aside to go into the wash. So look at that. Almost uh, That's a pretty deep bowl. These are pretty huge. And uh, look at all that popcorn. Half a cup of popcorn. That's easily five, five or six. I'd say six cups popped. And then, of course, my little mini. I love this. Um, if you'd like to book a party to me, these are only available to my hostesses. Uh, they're not for sale, and I just love them. I love anything small and mini. Pink, small, and mini. They'll get me every time. This is just uh, sea salt. The, I'm a big fan of sea salt, and um, yeah, so that's the kind of salt that's in there, and I just I give it a little shake, toss it. Give it a little shake to do that side. Give it another toss. And let's see if you can hear that crunch. Oh, you can hear just how lovely that is. I don't put butter on my popcorn. Um, yeah, I just, I like it. Just the corny, nutty, yummy goodness flavor of popcorn. Mmm. So good. So. I hope you will buy the stack cooker, and I hope you'll make more than popcorn in it. I certainly do. I'd be happy to make more videos. I, like I said, I cook casseroles, I cook lasagnas, meatloafs, um, 
rice, risotto, you name it, it can be cooked in the microwave in the stack cooker and it comes out lovely and perfect every single time. So if there's something you'd like to show me or would like me to demonstrate showing you how to cook in the stack cooker, just leave me a comment and I'd be happy to do that video. Until next time, have a great day and this is the Paper Possum saying see you later.